Today's Catan combination is Barbarian Attack, so there's the castle hex there, with four islands. So, as normal, we have already played it, um, and we just want to share the few things that we did or we noticed. So, number one, you'll see Catan chits randomly on the board. Those Catan chits are not up for grabs. That is where, if you build a settlement or a city, you roll three times to place the barbarians. Those are the hexes that get the barbarians. So basically, if you've played a barbarian attack before, the ones with the Catan chits represent the outer coastal hexes in the regular game. The knights do travel across the water, but there must be a shipping route in order to cross. And it doesn't have to be your own. Um, we were moving our knights across other people's shipping routes. Now, if you want a more competitive game, add in the coins. Um, you can definitely do that and pay each other. We did not. There is no largest army. However, there is the longest road and the harbor master. You use the barbarian attack development cards. There's no pirate, no robber. Uh, the base trade is of course four to one because there are harbors in this combination. We started our placement with two settlements anywhere we wanted and then used the traditional four island if you build on an island that was not your original placement, you get two victory points, the Catan chits on the side. If you roll a seven, there's no robber or pirate ship, so we just stole from any other player. And we played up to 13 victory points. So that's the gist of it. Let's see how this plays out. We rolled to see who goes first, and red is going to go first, so we'll show you the placement order. So, red's going to place a settlement, then blue, then orange, and then orange again, then blue, and red. Then red will place, um, we're going to represent with two roads, but you could build ships depending where you place it. So go ahead, two roads and then blue, and then orange. Okay, so again, they don't have to be roads, they can be ships, but that is the order of placement.
Orange won. Ryder won. Uh, 13 victory points. So he's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 8, 9, 10, 11. Uh, we can't see those. 10, 11. And then he built on one of the islands, so 12, 13. 12, 13. I thought it was a really good mix of games. Ryder, did you like that one? Yeah, especially the reason how you can bring your knights. Yeah, he liked the knights can go across the shipping routes and stuff like that. So that was pretty cool. So, awesome combination. Keep playing. Have fun.